Hello everyone, my name is Qi Chen, a researcher from Microsoft Research Asia. Together with Jing Dong Wang and the Bing Planfong team, we propose SPTAC++, hundreds of billion scale vector search with, with millisecond my, uh, response. First, let me give you a brief introduction of vector search. Given a set of data set X, which contains n vectors with m-dimensional uh, features, and our query vector Q, uh, the goal of vector search is to find a vector X from data set called nearest neighbor, that such that X has the minimal distance with the query vector Q in the whole data set. Similarly, we can define the K nearest neighbor search. Uh, vector search is ubiquitous, which can be widely used in various kinds of applications, such as similar image search, similar item search in the recommendation, and the similar answer search in the Q&A, and so on. Due to the importance of vector search, we have done research in this area for around 10 years, from improving KD tree, and, uh, and then invented nearest neighborhood graph based solutions, even before the population of deep learning. With the recent breakthrough in deep learning, content can be more meaningfully represented by vectors, not only the multimedia materials, but also the natural language materials. Vector search is now playing a more and more important role in deep information retrieval area. With the rapid growth of the vector scale in the um, deep learning area, uh, uh, here comes a challenge how can we serve uh, super large scale vector search? For example, hundreds of billion scale in the production. There exist two challenges. The first challenge is the capacity issue. Vector cannot be all fit into memory. We need to use SSD to store our vector and the index. Since there is a big gap between memory read and SSD read, one straightforward solution is to use cache. However, we found that cache has low efficiency. 50% of memory can only cache about 80% of access. Therefore, how to better leverage memory and SSD is a challenge for AN's algorithm design. The second challenge is the scalability issue. Uh, increasing number of machines will increase the query latency and the resource cost since the search will be done in each machine and the, and the latency will increase due to the increasing number of candidates for aggregation and also the delay of the long tail machine. How to provide better scalability is also a challenge for the vector search system design. Most of the AN solutions in the literature mainly focus on the fast, high recall search in all in memory. They cannot be used in the large-scale vector search scenarios due to the capacity issue. There are only a few approaches focused on the large-scale vector search. They can be divided into two categories, inverted index-based solutions, and also and the second is the graph-based methods. The inverted index-based methods divide the vectors into uh, k clusters and only do search in a few uh, clusters that are close to the query. The advantage of this solution is that every point is reachable. However, since there exist some long postings, putting all the postings in the disk make query latency hard to meet. Therefore, most of existing solutions store PQ compressed vectors and the posting list all in memory. Unfortunately, the recall is very low due to the additional lossy data compression. Graph-based methods conduct a nearest neighborhood graph for the whole data set and start a search from a for a query from some fixed start points. To reduce the memory cost, they store the graph in the slow device and put the PQ compressed vectors or uh, some pivot points in the fast memory. Since graph-based methods can achieve good recall and latency for uniform distributed Datasets, current state-of-the-art AN solutions are all graph-based solutions. However, we found that 
graph-based methods are hard to ensure the connectivity with limited edges for some skilled production data sets. This will lead to low recall issue for some queries. Therefore, we cooperate with Bing Platform team to propose SPTAC++, a new, simple, but efficient inverted index-based memory and disk hybrid AN solutions for the super-large-scale vector search. To use simple inverted index solution, there exist three challenges. Since we would like to put all the posing lists in the disk, imbalanced and long posing lengths makes query latency hard to meet. This requires us to not only partition the data into a large number of posing lists, but also balance the length of posing lists. This is very difficult due to the substantial high clustering cost and the balance partition problem itself. Since we only search a small number of nearest posing lists, the limited coverage will cause some true neighbors of Q that located in, the, in other posing lists uh, to be missing. You can see from the figure, if the red points only represented by the centroid of blue posing list, they will be missing in the nearest neighborhood search of yellow point, since the center of green postings is closer to the yellow point. Moreover, we find that different queries may have different search difficulties. You can see from the figure, more than 80% of queries only need to search about six uh, posting lists, while there are some queries requiring to search about uh, more than 100 posting lists. If we search the same number of posing lists for all queries, it will result in low, low recall or long latency. All of the above challenges are the reason why all the previous uh, inverted index-based solutions adopt low-C data compression solution that store all the compressed vectors and the posing, posing list in the memory. In SPTAC++, we propose three novel solutions to address these three challenges. To partition data into a large number of posing lists and balance the length of posing lists, we introduce a novel hierarchical balanced clustering, which can fast divide data into a large number of posing lists which, with the balanced constraint. Due to the time limitation, here we will not introduce the detail. You can find the details in our paper. To address the second challenges, uh, limit the coverage of nearest posing list, we propose selected posing list expansion technique, which just uh, closure boundary vectors into multiple clusters uh, in representative different directions. To further reduce the search cost of easy queries, we use a query availed dynamic pruning to dynamic decide the number of postings to be searched. This means we only search, uh, dispatch the query to the real near real near postings instead of top K nearest postings. By applying the three solutions in both distributed dispatch and the local search, we have SPTAC++, a new hierarchical data partition and partial search solution. We first balance cast all the data into M partitions. Here, M is the number of machines. And then we further partition the data in each machine into N partitions. Uh, here, N is a large number. When a query comes, we first dispatch the query to the nearest machines uh, and then uh, using some fast index to navigate the uh, query to the nearest postings that stored in the disk for the fine-grained search. Uh, here we demonstrate the current results. SPTAC++ has served hundreds of billion scale vector search in production with millisecond response. We can achieve more than five times memory saving compared to all in-memory AN solutions. And we can further achieve 50% latency gain to reach the required recall with disk-based AN compared with disk-based AN solutions. And uh, moreover, we can achieve 80% of resource saving and 68% of latency reduction compared to all such solutions. Finally, 
it has good scalability since we bound the resource usage for each query. Okay, that's all for our talk. Thanks.